Can you hear that? There's no Nur Muhammad in your face. Look. Gone and space. You talk to us from our dear from Google. You jahil. No, we're just gonna. Do not insult him. Do not insult him. Just leave him. Leave him. Leave him. So do you have any reference? Do you have the reference? Then we can discuss about the hadith. You don't talk. Okay. Give me reference. Who narrated the hadith? انت مسلم لا لازم تكذب تحترم الناس لا 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 you have the reference. I will wait. Take your time. I will find it. But yeah, okay. If you Google, you have to send. Yeah, I'll find. No, don't worry. Don't worry. Yeah, I will get for you. I mean, if you put in the the yeah. word, no problem. Straight. Plus, we need the context. Is there any Shia here? He's not, he's not a Muslim. He's not a Muslim. Why did you tell me he's Muslim? No, he's not a Muslim. He's not a Muslim. No, he's a Christian, yes? Yes. You're Christian, yes? He thinks you're Shia. No, he's Christian. He's ignorant, that's why. No problem. I know you're a Christian. You're ignorant. He's a Christian. He... <laughs> his, his mind is shrinking, his beard is growing. Okay, no problem. Do you have the reference? Because we are running out of time. We are running out of time. Even if we say, even if we say the hadith is uh, strong, let's say it's sahih, even that does not take you out of Islam. No, it's not. Yes. Because in the hadith, it's a sin. But it doesn't take you out of Islam. Because it, and plus, depends on what you stay for, the reason you stay for. No, no. If the reason you stay for Muhammad, to spread Islam and teach people Islam, Muhammad, then that the hadith has got nothing to do with no, you. No, no. Muhammad the point. did not mention Muslims who are living in European Mushrikeen country because he is studying there or is working there or he is da'wah in there. Nothing. He said. Anna Bari, you know, there is nothing. Is Anna you know what context Bari is? Or, wait, Anna, wait, wait, brother, wait. Okay, I'm explaining. Do you know what context is? Do you Anna, know the. Does, the co well, I'll give you. I am not going. I'm not going to explain why Muhammad. I will explain to you the hadith. No, no, and I'll no, give you no, another hadith I also. I don't believe in your words. Do you understand? Oh, me? so you believe only this hadith. So you take this hadith and the others I we put in our pocket. In is that what you want? Okay. Damn it, do you understand? Okay. You still looking. looking? Do you know the Prophet's companions used to live in a non-Muslim country, Ethiopia? Yeah. The Sahabas, Abyssinia. the first migration, the Sahabas, they turned was uh, towards Ethiopia. Ethiopia, Abyss Abyssinia, that was not a Muslim country. And this hadith, it does not say, it says generally. But you cannot just take one hadith and not use the rest of the hadith. It's like me using one verse of the Bible and not using the rest. So we need context. The hadith, even if the hadith is sahih, as I'm saying now, I'm repeating, it doesn't mean you're out of Islam. Do you, do you, do you it's a sin and depends on the reason you stay. If you are conveying the message of Islam, spreading the truth and you're seeking peace, then you can stay there. No, they didn't go there for spreading Islam. They were scared. They were saving their life. Why there. they went there? Because Arab, they are Arabs there. Yes. They tried to hurt them. That's why they went there. But they you didn't... said, but you said, Prophet said, if you stay in a non-Muslim country, he said, I'm not with that person. Anabari.
And a berry. So how can so are you telling me Prophet was well, berry you know, yeah. against his companions, the ones who lived in he Ethiopia? Was Muhammad is that so what you saying? To change it, so we need context. So many no, it's not about change. changing. Yeah, change it, we man. need context. If I go to Muslim non-Muslim countries and I spread Islam and teach people Islam and call people to Islam, the hadith is not about me. You need to get context. No, it's about context. You. you shouldn't leave. No, it's in about this context. Country. What am I doing here? What am I doing now? You? Yes, and what am I doing now? What is that? No, this is a sold in website. I'm asking for reference. Even I told him, even if the hadith is sahih, we need the context. If I'm spreading Islam and I go to non Muslim countries and I'm spreading Islam, then that's what Allah asked me. Allah said what? Prophet said what? He said, Prophet said, this is my way and I will call people to Islam. When Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam sent his companions to all around the world. So what, doing what? Spreading Islam. If you are to spread Islam and teach people Islam, then the hadith is not about us. Siraj. Siraj. Yes. Do you know Sheikh Fawaz? Salah Fawzan? Yes, but where is the reference until now? Yes, where is the reference now? He is talking about that hadith. Oh. Okay, listen, what does he say? He will tell you the context. You listen. If you don't believe me, no, listen to you. No, I'm not here. I'm just telling you, giving you the reference. Why is the when reference? When you go home, Why is the reference? to White Chapel No, Mosque. I want you to reference because the way you're referencing is wrong. This is just a, when you go tonight uh -huh. to White Chapel Mosque. Yeah. If you have a laptop, yes, you, you search for it. Yeah. No, I can search for me. I know how to search it. Okay. But the way you're referencing is wrong, and I give you the context. I right now. Right I give now, you the context. What's the point? What else? I Do you have any other you... question? Who are you? I'm here to ask you. I just I give you the context. Do you have Who any other you? question? Who are you? I'm me asking you questions. Because uh, because uh, you you are fanatic Muslim. Do you know that? Oh, oh. oh. fanatic Muslim. I'm, I'm so now now I just corrected you. No, no, you don't correct me. Okay? I just corrected you I, I, because you I, misquoted the hadith. I'm You're not this. putting Shell, the context. Bozan. I just said. Bozan. Now I repeat for you last time. I repeat for him last time. If the hadith is sahih, okay. Wait, wait, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me explain. I'm repeating last time, the hadith, yes. Yes. Now, I just said, I just said, to stay, to stay without a valid reason. Today is different, today Muslim, you don't have place. No, I understand, no, I'm saying with a valid reason, you can stay. But no, Muhammad has power. No, I'm saying Anybody to stay, to stay, to stay there no with a valid reason, like spreading Islam, seeking peace there. It's fine. But he's, he does not know about that. So I'm not. Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam also... No, no, wait, wait. No, I'm talking to the camera. No, I need to conclude to bring the... No, I'm saying... Yeah, I'm saying we need to put the context of the hadith. If the hadith even is acceptable, I'm saying what I'm saying, the way he's referencing is wrong, that's why I'm challenging him to show me the reference, because he's taken from websites. I want the reference. So, no, brother, wait, no, I'm talking to the camera. What I'm saying is, the hadith is, the hadith is sahih, it's correct. If you stay in a non-Muslim country without a valid reason, you are committing sin, but that does not take you out of Islam. He needs to understand that. Now, if Prophet you, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam if you sent his companions there, to stay in a non-Muslim country, to live in there, yeah. like it's, uh, their companions, the fifth year of the, his prophethood, he sent his companions to stay in Habash, in Ethiopia. Why? Because of a valid reason. So if you were there, if you're because of a valid reason, then that, the hadith, it's not about them. So he needs to understand the context. I'm telling him the context. He doesn't want the context. He wants to put to use that hadith only and not use not to to not use the rest of the hadith. So that's all I'm going to say. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I'm not repeating. I just explained to you.